it's katie and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new if so you can subscribe the button is always down below post beauty lifestyle panning and more and today's video is giving my update a little belated for the partners and cream project created by steph and dylan which i'll link down below yeah i'm running on low camera battery today or like a little bit so we're gonna just get right into it um this is update number four i think I really don't know where to start this month, but I guess I'll start with this. It's the Rare Beauty Blush in Nearly Mauve, I believe it's called. That's what it looks like or what it's looking like. I've been really bad take about I've been really bad by the way about taking progress pictures, but I'm wearing that one today, which we love. Um I have used this seven times. My goal is fifteen times, so we have um like eight more uses i think for that one um i've used it like quite a bit and i'm not really looking to like you know like i don't know i'm not looking to like really pan it i just want to get like use on it so so that's in this project very quick and easy for that one and then i added this in i believe last month and i had to revive it but this is the color pop jelly eyeshadow and hallucinogenesis i really like this color um, I thought this I was gonna throw it out because when I redid it, it kind of like, I don't know, it got too, too liquidy. So I had to like really stir it and I think it's made a new form. So this one, I haven't used too much of it. Um, I don't really remember what my goal was. I think like probably like 10 to 15 uses. So I'm just gonna keep going with that and see what happens. But I did wear this the other day and it was really pretty and it ended up working. But I'm going to continue to see what happens, I guess. I really don't know. Then I have my Bare Minerals Original Liquid Foundation in there. I did mark it there because I thought this is one of those pumps that like where it moves up. But I'm really not sure, to be honest. Um, but I've used this, I believe, five times this month. I think that's how I'm keeping track of it. Yeah. Um, so I've only used it five times this month. I'm trying to use it more, but I'm kind of getting bored with this, so I might take it out for a bit and then maybe add it in. Um, I think I'm gonna give it like another month before deciding that because really I'm seeing nothing with this and I'm just, I'm wanting to like work on something else as I'm finding. I don't know. So we'll see on that one. I'll give it a month before changing that up. Then the next three things I'm like, one of them's rolled out and the other two are just good progress. So this one is the Tarte Ultra Creamy Concealer. Um, I don't know if you're gonna be able to tell, but I did mark it at about right there. It's really hard to see and it won't focus. We love that. Come on, focus. There we go. Um, so it is at about right there with it and we'll kind of see what happens. I feel like looking in, it's like pretty much at the bottom. It's at the point right now where even though the stopper's out, like literally nothing's coming out. You definitely can't see in there. So I might take like a really small like eyeshadow brush and see if I can scrape some of the product out. But I guess, I don't know. I think this will be out by next update, which is really exciting because I actually have a lot of concealers in my collection currently so it'd be nice to roll another one in. So next is the lip oil in Playa Vista. I, this was originally a 30 use goal but then I added it in since I was making such good progress on it. Again making good progress like look at those lines um, right there and I think it's like down here-ish. I'm getting to the point where I'm debating taking this stopper out just because it is down so low and minimal stuff is coming out i definitely think i could work to get getting this out by the next update i am making pretty good progress i'll try to take pictures because it's easier to be able to show that way sometimes but i really do think i could get this out in a month which is exciting and i've been really enjoying this like i mentioned last month this is like a product that i like really fell in love with after panning. So I always love when that works out like that. And then lastly, I have my NARS. This is like a lip balm. I forget what shade it's in. I can't read that because it's way too small. Um, this I depotted out of here because there wasn't that much left, but I still wanted to get usage on it. And I scraped the whole thing out. It in here, I believe last month, and really that's all that's left. And 
that's like nothing like nothing can be scraped even from that so that I'm calling done and I'll be able to roll something else in which I think I know what I want to roll in I think I do I'm gonna give myself a moment to really decide and then I'll come back with what's rolling into this project okay so this month I will be rolling in a, another glossy lip oil, but this one's in clear, so this will be good for like my day-to-day -day wear because I don't always wear this color like to work or just on the day-to-day -day basis. I don't always wear that. Um, I'm not really sure where this one is at, um, and I don't want to like squeeze it or anything to see like where it's at, but this is what it looks like. It's just a little baby sample I got from Ipsy. And I'm hoping to get this out in just a couple months. I'm hoping this will be a quicker rollout. So yeah, I think next month we'll be done with this Tarte concealer and the lip oil could be out as well, which is exciting. I'm gonna make my decision if I want to keep this in or if I want to just refresh. Um, just cause I'm getting like tired of using this and I kind of want to like revive it a little bit. Um, I think the Ray Beauty blush will possibly be out. We'll see. Um, I'm okay with like long haul products being in this project just because it's more general and just not like fun prompts. But I feel like this is a very like casual update. It's definitely not as long as my other updates um, and stuff. But yeah, we love a good quick update, especially if it's belated. I'm going to try and get this up on a Tuesday, tomorrow Tuesday, which I believe is the 14th. So it's only going to be like four days away. <laughs> Oh boy, we love when that works out like that or when that happens. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know how your projects are going as well. And and like what updates are you like making? What what's happening with your projects, I guess. And be sure to subscribe. So, and be sure to subscribe if you haven't already, just so you don't miss any panning amazing content. I also have to do my update my mid-year update on my makeup inventory, which I'll try to do that beginning of July, I think. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching again, and I will see you in my next video. Bye!